Hey, CrossFit Mainline, what's up? Coach Ray here. Check it out for your lockdown want today. We are primarily working with our body weight. Uh, after a brief warm up, you're gonna work your way through some midline work. We're gonna do this midline work Tabata style. So that's eight rounds total of 20 seconds of effort followed by 10 seconds of rest. Uh, you're gonna cycle through these four movements, a side plank, uh, alternating V-ups, side plank on the other side, and then flutter kicks. That's four rounds right there. You're gonna go through that two times. Uh, we're engaging the core and getting us nice and primed for today's workout. Today's conditioning piece is something called Murph-ish. It's kind of like the traditional hero lot that we do every Memorial Day, uh, but it's a little shorter and we don't have pull-ups programmed in the workout at all. You're gonna start things off with an 800 meter run, then work your way through 50 push-ups, 100 sit-ups, and then 200 air squats. Once you're done with that workload, you're gonna finish the same way you got started with that 800 meter run. Now this middle portion of the workout, you can partition however you like. So if you wanna do uh, five rounds of uh, 10, 20, and 40, you can break it up that way. If you wanna do 10 rounds of five, 10, and 20, you can do it that way. Uh, but you're just breaking that up however you see fit to chip your way through the workout. Now if you wanna kick this up a notch, uh, you can actually wear a weighted vest for that RX Plus option. That could get spicy, but I'm sure it's a lot of fun. Uh, so that is your workout today. The hardest part of that workout will likely be those push-ups. You're using a really small muscle group to get the work done, and so they'll probably fatigue pretty quickly in the workout. So uh, break those up early, break those up often, uh, so that you can chip your way through Murph-ish. That's your wad brief. Uh, this is what the movements look like. Happy wadding. I'll see you soon.